This is a message from the Pleiades. You had a President Kennedy, and he said, Seek not what your country can do for you, but what you can do for your country. We say also, Seek not what God can do for you, but what you can do for God, or the Creator, or the Great Father, Mother, however you wish to call this creator energy that lives in your heartbeats, that lives in love, that lives in the love that you give out into the world, lives in the light that you give out into the world. Seek not what communication with extraterrestrials can do for you, but what you can do for the extraterrestrials. And we mean that in cooperation, as you raise your vibration and give and serve and grow, then this is a cooperation which helps us to help you move more into your fourth density, fifth dimensional life as an individual and as a planet. Seek not what others can give to you, but what you can give to others. And in giving to others, it creates a reciprocal relationship where what you need is given back to you at the same time, if not the same time exactly, but it re does return to you. We give you this message as you prepare for the upcoming celebration of the birth of Jesus. Jesus was and continues to be quite real, his teachings seemingly simple but quite profound, especially love your enemy and love God as you love yourself. If you do not love yourself, it is hard to love God or to receive in your heart, to feel the beautiful love of God within your heart and within your being. And loving your enemy, yes, this has always been one of the hardest things to do. Because when you feel extremely wronged, it is difficult to digest it in such a way that you can reap the benefits from it and grow from it and grow gratitude out of it and then grow forgiveness from it. There are so many things in this world that happen as a consequence of previous actions set in motion a consequence of decisions that you have made at different times in your life. But when something happens to you, it is so emotionally traumatic in that moment that it is difficult to step back and look at it from a historical perspective for incidences happening on the world level, but also your own personal history and historical perspectives. It is a great challenge and for this you need one another. It is said that your greatest strengths is when others know your weaknesses. And for this it is important to have a trusting community. 
So we give you this message with love and a way to prepare your heart for this coming season when, even though Jesus was not born on December 25th necessarily, but the angels and your conscious connections in this country of the United States and all over the world who are celebrating, bring forth the good spirits, bring forth the angels to take advantage of your heart of service and giving and charity, especially at this time of year. And so they work to increase that attitude, that growth, to fan the flames of love and giving and service to each other. Even if that is not the mindset of all who are giving, but nonetheless, the action of giving and thinking of others, no matter what the original intention, maybe it is out of obligation, but that does not matter. It is the act of actually thinking of someone else and making effort to give them something, and it does not have to be anything material. Nonetheless, it is that action which attracts a like energy to want to help humanity grow this spirit. And this is what you call the Christmas spirit. Of course, there are other religions celebrating important teachers and masters at this time, but it is all the same. There is still the attitude of celebration and giving and charity and the effort to emulate the life and the love and the actions of all of the masters. This is beautiful. And this is what Good Spirit World and the angels come to increase in this time. We are also with you. We are ready and always ready to communicate with you. Again, remember that you are giving to us as we are giving to you. And please think what you are giving and what you can offer to all around you, to your family, to your friends, to your community, to the people you work with, to the extraterrestrials, to God, and to those in need. And all what you need will come back to you. We offer you much love and support in this time, and we remain your friends in ascension. Namaste.